We're here on Fox Grove, just a short distance away from frequent bus services and tram links to the city centre and surrounding areas for a video tour of this two double bedroom, versatile end terrace family home offered to the market with no upper chain and ideal for a first time buyer looking to take their first step onto the property ladder. So just starting off at the front of the property, have the main entrance door straight ahead which takes us into the living room. Area does also operate a parking permit scheme as well, which are available to both residents and visitors. And then just having a look round inside the property. So we have the living room initially, which is a good size reception space. And a good size window to the front of the property. Radiator just behind the door and then an access door straight through to the fantastic dining kitchen. Just through the door on our left from the kitchen, we have access to a useful understairs pantry storage cupboard, which does have lighting, gives us handy storage space. Dining kitchen has low maintenance flooring, plenty of space for a good sized table and chairs, and is also fitted with a good range of modern base and eye level units. Plenty of storage with timber finished work surfaces over. Owner is happy to leave behind the range cooker and fitted extractor canopy. There's also a built-in Siemens dishwasher as well, which is only a couple of years old, just underneath the one and a half bowl sink. And if we just have a look from the other side of the room, we have a fridge and freezer. Again, happy to leave those behind, just next to the door, which opens up to the staircase to the first floor. We then have the separate utility room. Door on the left takes us out to the back garden, which we'll have a look at a bit later on. We have a further range of units for useful storage. There's space and provision for both a washing machine and tumble dryer. Again, owner is happy to leave those behind. And we then have access to the family bathroom, which is fitted with a three-piece suite. So we have the wash basin, bath with glazed shower screen and mains pressure control shower, as well as a dual flush WC. And then just having a look around on the first floor. So we have access to two double bedrooms, both a similar size. We have bedroom number one on our left and then bedroom number two on our right. Just having a look at bedroom number two to start off with, situated to the front of the property. Plenty of space in here for a double bed as well as freestanding bedroom furniture, currently being utilised as an office. It's also worth mentioning that we do also have hardwired Cat5 cabling. You can see the ports there just underneath the desk, with the exception of the kitchen. Plenty of sockets throughout the property as well. We then have bedroom number one. Again, plenty of space for at least a double bed, as well as a variety of items of freestanding bedroom furniture. We have a useful wash basin, window overlooking the back garden, and there's also useful fitted storage cupboards as well, which also houses the Worcester Bosch boiler. Staircase then takes us up to the loft space and underneath the stairs and to the overstairs bulkhead we have a useful storage cupboard. And then just having a look at the loft space currently being used as a work area. Ideal for those that are looking to work from home. Nice and versatile, plenty of space for desks or alternatively freestanding bedroom furniture could also be used as a further reception space and on top of that we have handy storage to both side of the eaves. And then just to finish off the tour we'll have a look at the rear garden so all designed with low maintenance in mind, plenty of space out here for garden furniture enclosed on all elevations for privacy and there's also a useful timber shed just tucked away at the end of the garden, which also has the benefit of armoured cabling, which provides power.